William Etty, born on March 10, 1787, in the charming city of York, embarked on a journey that would redefine the artistic landscape of the Victorian era. His early life was marked by a latent artistic passion that surfaced through chalk sketches on the wooden floor of his father's shop. Despite familial resistance, Etty's artistic promise led him to the Royal Academy in London, where he studied under the tutelage of luminaries such as Thomas Lawrence. Apprenticed as a printer at the age of 11, Etty found an escape from the monotony of his work through drawing. His apprenticeship years were marked by a longing for artistic freedom. As evident in his poignant words upon its completion in 1805, not the liberty of licentiousness and Jacobinism, but natural rational freedom of body, mind and will. This period of restraint fueled his determination to pursue artistic excellence. Etty's artistic journey took a transformative turn when he embarked on a European tour. His exposure to the artistic treasures of France, particularly Rubens's Marie de Medici cycle, left an indelible imprint on his creative sensibilities. The journey continued through Dijon, Switzerland, and Milan, culminating in Florence, 
where the masterpieces of Leonardo da Vinci awaited. Despite some disappointment in Rome, Etty's European sojourn enriched his artistic palette. Etty's artistic journey was punctuated by triumphs and controversies. His notable works, including, The Triumph of Cleopatra, 1821, The Combat, Woman Pleading for the Vanquished, 1825, and, Youth on the Prow, and Pleasure at the Helm, 1832, reflected his ability to intertwine classical themes with a contemporary flair. The intricacies of his personal life, including his close relationship with his niece Betsy, added a human dimension to the narrative. As Etty advanced in age, his reflections on life and art became more introspective. Expressing a desire for virtuous happiness and a decent competency, he contemplated the balance between academic rank, fame, and personal contentment. His commitment to life classes, even after achieving royal academician status, drew both admiration and criticism from his contemporaries.
William Etty's legacy endures through his artistic contributions and the ongoing fascination with his life. The critical analyses of his works, such as, The Wrestlers, delve into themes of physicality, race, and paint, offering a nuanced understanding of his artistic choices. Exhibitions, publications, and scholarly discussions continue to shed light on the complexity of Etty's art and its significance in the broader context of 19th-century British art. In retrospect, William Etty's narrative emerges as a tapestry woven with passion, controversy, and artistic innovation. From the wooden floor of his father's shop to the grand galleries of Europe, Etty's artistic journey is a testament to the enduring power of creativity. As we navigate the pages of history and explore the strokes of his brush, we rediscover the man behind the canvases, a Victorian artist who dared to challenge, inspire, and leave an everlasting imprint on the annals of art.